New here at 11, police spring into action after a Metro Detroit mom and her four-year-old get stuck inside a car wash. It happened earlier this week at the Brownstown Automatic Car Wash on Telegraph. And as Larry Spruill reports, this mom is very grateful for the officers who came to help her and her son. Rebecca Hodge says it was a normal trip here to this Brownstown Automatic Car Wash on Telegraph Road earlier this week. Her four-year-old son, Zachary, was just released from the hospital. Rebecca said he's been going through chemotherapy and she wanted to give him a different view besides the inside of a hospital room. My four-year-old son um, was diagnosed with neuroblastoma, which is a rare childhood cancer. Plus, her car was dirty, so she wanted to get it washed. I've used this car wash before. It's a local-owned company, um, and I've never, ever had a problem. My vehicle was washed, okay? Everything worked properly until I went to leave. When I went to leave, that was a whole different scenario. 911, where's your emergency? Um, yes, I'm stuck in a car wash. Okay, where are you at? I'm at Telegraph between, like, kind of kitty corner to the Brownstown Police Station. Local 4 obtained this 911 call. When I went to pull forward to grip traction because there's, like, cement there, there was a sheet of ice, so my front tire spun. Hodge says it was at that time a part of the car wash machine allegedly slammed into her car. It was definitely something different for Brownstown Police Chief Jeff Watson. We don't uh, often get called to rescue people from car washes. So the officers were able to figure out a way to get her out of there and get her out of that bad situation. It took them about five minutes to get my vehicle out. And Rebecca wants to thank the two officers who helped her get out there. Their names are officers Camille Glitton and Eric Mott. Now she says she's also dealing with the insurance company to help out with the damage to her car. We are live tonight. Larry Spruill, Local 4.